We're in VirtualBox 6. I'm going to show you how to change the amount of RAM assigned to a virtual machine. And I'm just going to start out by showing you how much RAM that we have currently. So if we click on the Task Manager Memory under Performance, we can see we have 2 gigabytes. And it's currently using 30% or 0.6 of those 2 gigabytes. So let's say, hey, I want to make this 4 gigabytes, make it run a little faster. Well, no problem, except for first we have to shut down the virtual machine. We can't do this while it's live. Once it's shut down, we're going to go into the settings of the virtual machine and we'll make a change so we can have more RAM showing. Now we'll take a look at this same virtual machine. We'll right click on it and choose settings. And now we're going to go to where it says system. And we can see the base memory. This is the RAM that's assigned to the virtual machine. So I'm going to change that to 4096, which is 4 gigabytes. We could also just slide the scale up as well. And we can see we have a maximum of 16. However, the maximum of 16 means that's the maximum amount I have, I have on my host. So you don't want to do that, or the host won't run right anymore. So you want to make sure that all your virtual machines together don't equal uh, the same amount as your host. You want to leave at least 6 to 8 gigabytes free for your host to continue to run. Otherwise, your virtual machines won't run correctly. All right, so once that's all done, we'll click OK, and we'll double-click on a virtual machine. And when it comes back up, we go into Task Manager, we should see that it's now 4 gigabytes. We're logged back into our virtual machine. I'm going to go to the Task Bar, right-click, and choose Task Manager. And then I'm going to go to Performance, and now we see 4 gigabytes. Another interesting thing to note is that now we're using 0.9 gigabytes. So sometimes when you add more RAM, you end up using more of it, even though you're not using any programs. And that's because it's going to use part of your hard drive as the, uh, the RAM if it doesn't feel that it has enough to do that with. Another reason could be that th during the startup phase, it needs to use a little bit more RAM, but then after it's done using that RAM, it will calm down a bit and then it will go back to what it was before. But in any case, you now have more RAM, and your virtual machine should run faster.